How's it going out there, folks? Welcome back here to a Monday late afternoon here, about 5.14 p.m. here, California time, October 7th, 2024. Large earthquake coming into the Kermadec Trench area. This is a 6.0 coming in. Uh, north here of North Island, New Zealand. Now, the USGS not picking up on this earthquake as of yet. Uh, as far as any tsunami statement goes, uh, let's check this out here real quick, see what we have. Uh, nothing shown up yet from the Tsunami Warning Center. Uh, again, this earthquake just coming in to the New Zealand area, showing up pretty nicely here on uh, one of the stations. This station is actually in between North and South Island down there, so it's picking it up rather strong. And uh, let's see if the uh, GeoNet servers have jumped on this yet. Check this out real quick. Nothing uh, showing up there on their map. There we go. So, yeah, 6.2. They're actually, yeah, a little bit larger. 6.2, 16 minutes ago, unnoticeable earthquake. And that's yeah, it's because it's a distance there away from any uh, populated areas. But apparently a couple folks down there around Wellington and the uh, South Island area reported feeling that earthquake. But, uh, yeah, 6.2 at a uh, fairly decent-sized earthquake just off... Uh, North Island Coast area. Let me see here if USGS is picking back up on it. Nothing yet. Nothing. So EMSC is the uh, place right now picking up uh, the the earthquake activity. Let's run over here real quick and see what they have. Kermadec Trench. This is uh, 57 kilometers deep for that. Looks like there was another one here. Maybe an older earthquake. A little bit shallower though uh, from earlier today so now we got deeper activity here so that's a sign here of maybe some bigger quake activity about ready to happen across this area I know North Island and down here across the Cook uh, Strait area has been quite active there in uh, the region the past couple days so we'll continue to watch that nothing showing up from USGS map here uh, pretty strong flare kicking up here as well. Look at that long duration X flare. Uh, we had an X 2.1 and then another X peak out here at an X1. And it's just currently flaring with uh, consistency out here. Look at this massive flare that's taking place here from a far side sunspot area. This is the source of the last couple X flares that we've seen, including the largest one, the X 9.1 that we've seen a few days ago from that sunspot that was out here recently but now it's starting to flare back up here as it's drifting off towards the western limb again fairly massive uh, sunspot out there that's producing that super large flare goodness all right so yeah uh usgs no surprise downgrading this to a 5.8 either way uh, some earthquake activity ramping up here this one uh, actually they're showing a 6.2 miles deep here comparable to the previous one from yesterday so take your pick either way signature of a large earthquake showing up there on the seismograph station stay safe folks uh, we're just out here on the side kind of watching and monitoring stuff uh, we'll cover all this and more in a later update tonight for the monday night update so we'll catch you guys back here then